How would you calculate this sum in your head if you could not use a calculator? 42 squared plus 126 squared. If you see two numbers like this being squared and added together, it's tempting to think that the order doesn't matter, that you could actually add them together first and then square them. But you can quickly verify this won't really work if you test it out with a much simpler example. Using something like three and four, we can see pretty easily three squared plus four squared, that is nine plus 16 makes 25, definitely does not equal 3 plus 4, that is 7, squared. There is actually a clever way to connect these two different sums, but we'd have to subtract away twice the product of the two numbers in order to get the equality to work out. 3 plus 4, again, that is 7 squared makes 49, 2 times 3 times 4 is 24, and in fact 49 minus 24 is 3 squared plus 4 squared makes 25. In this particular case though, that means to compute it that way, not only would we have to add 42 and 126 and then square that really large number, we would then have to double the product of 42 and 126 and subtract that away all in our head. So this clearly is not the best approach. What we wanna notice instead is that there's actually a connection between 42 and 126. 126 is the same thing as three times 42. So in fact, another way to write this is 42 squared plus three times 42 squared, and then something interesting happens. We can distribute a square over a product. So in fact, this is the same thing as 42 squared plus three squared times 42 squared, and 3 squared, of course, we know pretty easily is 9. So this is 142 squared plus 9 more 42 squared makes 10 times 42 squared. You would still have to have a decent trick for how to compute 42 squared in your head, but if you know that that's 1,764, 10 times that is obviously just 17,640. Once we put it this way, we can see the more general pattern. Any number squared plus three times that number squared will always equal 10 times that number squared. So computing any problem like this in your head really only requires your ability to square the first number and then just add a zero to whatever that is.